Hey, what's going on guys? Rob Willis Thought Info here and today in this video I want to talk a little bit about Steam and what they got going on. So they just recently announced their Steam OS and there's all this talk about the Steam boxes and it kind of got me thinking maybe I should give Steam a read look. It's been a minute since I've played on Steam, probably since the Half-Life 2 days. But um, what you're going to see here is Steam running on Windows 7. And the one thing I want to talk about is their big picture mode. So if you notice in your Steam client, in the top right hand corner, you'll see the big picture button. So go ahead and click that to fire it up. And here we go. So my setup for this one is going to be an older Intel Q6600. And I got dual NVIDIA 8800 GTs in it running an SLI, 512 megs a piece. And it should be decent for this kind of thing. But uh, you see under the settings, it gives you options for uh, about, it just gives you general system information. And um, there's options for the display, it gives you information about the card. You see I'm running at 1920 by 1200 or 1080p as the active resolution. There's options for the controller, all kind of stuff like that. So let's go ahead and check out the store real quick. So here you can see all the options for the Steam games and their prices and everything. And there's all kind of hookups for deals and everything. You see they prompt you for your birthday before they allow you to check out games that are you know 18 plus or mature rated but um overall it's got a very playstation 3 like feel i think and um it works very well they've done a really good job designing the menu layout and everything and um really kind of catering to the gamers which is nice it's it's something that i don't think you see as much nowadays and then there's options for your library so you can just check out the games that you already own and there's other options for the community as well um all in all i think it's a very impressive direction that you're going with and I think I'm definitely interested in the Steam OS and maybe even getting a Steam box. Um, and then you see that you can return to your desktop or ex exit Steam and, and stuff like that. But um, like I said, all in all, it's, it's very impressive software and I, I like the direction that Steam is going with this and I'm looking forward to the things that they're going to do in the future. And uh, that's pretty much all I have to say. Uh, thanks for watching and Rob Willis.info out. <laughs> Go, 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 go,